What's up guys, Siobhan here, back with a quick video. Now this video is basically just a feature I found out in iOS 11. I'm not sure if everyone knows about it, I'm not sure if it has been spoken about before, but essentially it's just a feature that gets you started with your new phone. So if you have a 7 plus or an older device, I think this works from the 5s, comes up 5s and later, but basically if you have an older device you could transfer all your data from this device straight to your new device. Now this will transfer stuff like your Wi-Fi passwords, your contacts, and all the essential stuff. So basically, what you need to do is just start up setting up this phone, which is right here. So, as you can see, I got the pop-up set up new iPhone. So it's telling me that all I have to do is blah, blah blah my email address. So let me just hit continue right here. So it says waiting for other iPhone. So as you can see, it's waiting for this iPhone to connect here. So basically, just like the AirPods and the Apple Watch where you have these bubbles, you just hold your phone over these bubbles right here. And just like that, it's connected. So it says, finish on new iPhone. Keep this iPhone near your new iPhone while your information is being transferred. So here, all I need to do is just enter the passcode. So let me just do that real quick. Just like that, entered my passcode. Now, set up Touch ID, set that up later. Let me just let me just do it real quick, guys. What the process is like, and it's really, really fast and convenient. So as I said before, this doesn't, I, I don't think it brings over applications. It definitely brings over Wi-Fi password, your data, all the Wi-Fi, um, all your passwords like if you run a website and for example your Facebook password you could auto show your password and everything so you'd have to do everything all over again let me just enter my iCloud account right here all right so as you can see guys we're off to a good start and as you can see also the true tone display is working well on my F iPhone 8 plus as you can see this one is really cool and this one is kind of warm so basically what it's doing right now is transferring everything so as you can see iphone 7 backup chevron's iphone was last backed up on september 22 2017 at 4 34 pm would you like to back up now so you can restore your new phone blah blah hmm restore from september backup that's just just a while ago so that wouldn't be bad. But as you can see, it gave us the option, which is good. Hit agree, agree again. He can now be used as blah, blah, So I think it's done. Let's just fly through the setup process real quick. But yes, guys, that's basically the setup process. Now it's restoring everything from iCloud. Um, I'll just let it stay here. And when it's finished, I'll come back to the video and we're back so as you can see the phone basically just rebooted now it's back as you can see i have my wallpaper here i don't have to change my wallpaper anymore it's already there open my my home screen this is my first page let's see if i have everything right here so i need to enter my passcode let me do that so nice 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 cancel i won't appear my apple watch it all right guys so it even gave me back my entire application so you can see my inbox app right there the photos app my humber app blackboard everything is organized and waiting for me which is really really cool bitmoji pb wix everything's aligned perfectly yeah, so that's basically it. So it's basically downloading all the apps right now. So I'll just give it some time. So that's it basically for this video. Showing you a quick setup process with iPhone to iPhone. So if you have an old one and you just got a new one, this is the easiest way to transfer all your files and data without having to be using a computer. So if you enjoyed the video, drop a like down below guys. And always love, peace and tweaks. Signing out.